My name is Councillor Terry O'Neill, leader of Wellington Borough Council, and I'm here to officially launch the Nuclear Forum. Just before I hand over to Andy, um, I'd like to say a couple of thank yous. I'd like to say thank you to Susan Spivey and the Birchwood Forum. I'd like to say thank you to Jonathan Walsh from MEPC, providing facilities for the forum to continue, and Birchwood Forum are actually underpinning the, the management of it to ensure that we have, actually have a nuclear forum in, in Warrington. Now, what I recognise that Sellafield Limited and the nuclear research and development and all the supply chain that's at Birchwood is a key anchor to Warrington's economy. So I, I'm, I'm really pleased that the nuclear forum is continuing and I'd like to hand over to Andy Elsden who's going to talk a bit about what that entails. Thank you. Thanks, so I'm uh, Andy Elsden from the National Nuclear Laboratory. I'm here on behalf of a number of companies who've actually set up the nuclear forum. The intent of the forum is to provide a, a vehicle for informed networking for businesses in the Warrington and Cheshire area. We have our first meeting on the 14th of November. We're expecting uh, to talk about the Sulfield procurement processes and what's in the pipeline there. We're also very keen to look at all aspects of the nuclear sector across all areas in the UK. So we'd welcome more participation from businesses. We don't actually have any promotional material just yet, but I'm sure if you uh, talk to Susan Spivey of the Birchwood Forum, you'll be able to get the details. So I look forward to seeing some of you at the first meeting. Thank you. I'm here today with uh, Susan Spivey from the Birchwood Nuclear Forum. Welcome, Susan. Thanks very much, Neil. Nice to be here. Now, Susan, we've had the launch, the official launch of the uh, Birchwood Foot Nuclear Forum today. Um, how do you feel this will pan out in the future? Well, we're delighted to say that the, uh, we've established a steering group and uh, they've met this week to talk about future programme. And uh, the intention is to have the first meeting on the 14th of November in Birchwood. We're delighted that uh, MEPC, Birchwood Park, have agreed to host the, uh, the meetings for us in the first instance. But what we do hope is that um, it's not just Birchwood businesses, it's a, an initiative for the whole of the North West. So we're looking to uh, link in with uh, the businesses in Cheshire East, Cheshire West, and, uh, and in the north of the region. And we also have established links with uh, the business clusters in Cumbria as well. So it, it aims to develop the supply chain and, uh, and business development for all. So we're delighted with the, with the move now. And uh, there's no doubt that the, um, the north of England, including Cheshire, is, uh, is a great cluster for nuclear expertise. So how many members have we actually got involved now with uh, the Nuclear Forum? Well, there are 40 businesses uh, who've signed up already, but we expect that to grow enormously um, when the uh, launch takes place of the first meeting, so when there's something... To, to get the teeth into, we, we think they'll all, all be starting to, to join then. So. But 40 is a, an excellent start. Oh, fantastic start. And what we'd like to do as part of Nuclear TV is to cover events um, that the Nuclear Forum uh, is putting on and to profile it regularly on Nuclear TV. Would that be possible, Susan? That would be wonderful. And, and I'm delighted that uh, Nuclear TV has taken off and Urenko is supporting that. And uh, can I say, you know, watch this space. We're delighted to, to be working with you. Thank you. Okay. Well, thank you very much for joining me today.